a really big God bless you friends. I just wanted to share a few thoughts with you. The very same people, the very same people, the very same lying politicians are the same politicians who are telling us about Ukraine and Russia, the ones who lied non-stop for the last two and a half years about everything that has been going on with this so-called pandemic, which by the way, more people seem to have it now than ever before, and all the restrictions are being lifted. Don't you find that really interesting? I find that very interesting. The very same politicians that said that we are saving lives when they were actually doing the exact opposite. They were doing the exact opposite. These are the ones who are telling us all about Ukraine and Russia. Friends, it's the same mainstream media, CNN, BBC, Sky News, telling us all about Ukraine and Russia. It's the same people. It's the same organisations. It's the same institutions. It's the very same thing, friends. How can we believe them? This is like listening to Satan, the father of lies, and believing a single word that he utters. Friends, we cannot believe a word from them. We cannot believe anything that is happening in Russia and Ukraine that is coming from the mainstream media. The first casualty of war is truth. The first casualty of war is truth. We are being propagandized. We are being hypnotized, friends, yet again with another narrative. And by and large, people follow like lemmings over a cliff. We are being hypnotized. We are being controlled. This is a strategy set against us. Psychological manipulation. This is propaganda, friends. More propaganda to take our world. They want to take our world into the Great Reset. The World Economic Forum, friends, Klaus Schwab, and all of those people, evil people at the top who are pulling the strings, friends. We cannot believe a word from Boris Johnson. We cannot believe a word from Jacinda Ardern. We cannot believe a word from any of these politicians, friends. Justin Trudeau, when he talks about Ukraine, when you look up on the British government website and it says an unprovoked attack, unprovoked. Friends, it wasn't unprovoked at all. It wasn't unprovoked. We just need to do a little bit of research, friends, and we can find the truth ourselves. Friends, when our politicians and when the mainstream media are telling us something, we can be sure, we can be sure that we are being sold another big fat lie. Friends, let us not be deceived. This is part of the system of the Antichrist. It cannot tell the truth. It's impossible because that father, that father, friends, is the father of lies. Let us be wise in this day, friends, and let us not give ourselves over to this governmental system. Let us not bow down for a single moment because following any part of the narrative is a form of bowing down. Friends, let us bow only to God because our God is a consuming fire. And friends, He's not only a God of love, he is also a God of wrath. Let us make sure, friends, that we are on the right side in this day. Just a little warning, friends, just a little message there to say, let's not believe them, people. Let's not believe those liars, friends. They lied to us for two and a half years. How can they be telling the truth now? How can CNN, how can Sky News, how can the BBC be telling the truth? No, friends, we know when they speak, we are being sold a lie. Let's not forget it, friends. Let's remember. Let's remember, friends, to engage with the truth, who is Jesus Christ. He is the way. He is the truth. He is the life. So really big, God bless you, friends. Let us come up to God in this hour. Let us come up to him and let us seek his face. And he will give us everything we need, friends, and he will lead us. He will lead us into all truth. So a really big God bless you. Love you always. I'll speak to you again another time.